This is Lola Lee T. Hey everyone, how are you guys doing? Welcome to my channel. So Blueface and Krishan are both very, very, very quiet. And we all know what that means. The last video, I told you that Blue and Krishan were at the same place at the same time. Krishan was singing her Blueface diss song while Blueface watched from the crowd. She performed her diss song with Blueface watching somewhere in the crowd. And I asked you all if you thought that was an accident. Krishan had posted that she gave some random person her blue face pendant while in the restroom. But I want to know what led up to that. She said on numerous occasions that she was not parting with it. And I'm just wondering if maybe they got into some sort of argument or something. Because Krishan is very impulsive. And that obviously seems like a very impulsive thing to do. Just giving some random person the pendant. So I'm wondering, was she trolling when she said that she gave the pendant away? Was she trying to get some sort of a reaction out of Blueface? Or did they have some sort of argument and she actually did give it away? And I'm actually wondering, if she did give it away, what could be next? Could it be that she is going to get rid of the tattoos next? And word on the street is that Blueface got the pendant back. And why would the recently engaged Blueface do something like that if he has moved on? Why would he care if she gave it away? But guys, don't be worried for Krishan. She said on the Jason Lee show that she plays dumb. But did you, do you know, what is your identity? And like, do you know who you are now? I've been who I was. Even in all that? Yeah. It's what? called playing dumb. So the Hennessy, the throwing up on the playing side of the dumb. car. Playing dumb. Playing dumb. Now I live in a $2.9 million house for playing dumb. Mm -hmm. And then got smarter. And sober. <laughs> but yeah. Playing dumb. With a crip LA weird ass nigga. Yeah. That you still love. And I think that she still very much loves Blueface. But I think that she has learned from her financial mistakes. She said that Blueface recouped $2.9 million of her money. Listen to this. The social security card, all that. So the reason why all the money was going to him was because you weren't set up to handle your money. Is that true? Incorrect. So look. Because I remember so I had, had the shoebox. So remember look, last time we were talking yeah, about shoebox? Yeah, 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 yeah. So like, nah. So that's the thing. He knew my situations and stuff like that. Um. I was going through a lot. We was traveling a lot, but we never made time for me to get my shit together. But we always made time for him to get his shit together. So it it would never really be downtime for me. And then I was irresponsible with it because I'm thinking like, yo, had my back to the point where like, I don't know. I'm just used to people loving me unconditionally and treating me with, I don't know, like, a, like, like, like he my safety net. Like I'm thinking he my safety net. Whole T, I had to worry about all these things to make sure. He don't fuck me over. Like, that's what I don't like. Like, my little brother, I don't have to do certain things to make sure I'm straight. We all straight. Mm -hmm. You're going to just make sure that my name is cool. I got this account separate and we got, I'm good and yeah, cool. But every time I try to figure certain shit out, it was just like, I was running into like other shit. Like, I had warrants. Um, I couldn't show my face certain places or they had come. You remember the bounty hunters came and got me? I do remember that. Okay, we so it. if I register for anything, did anything, bank account, anything, they would track my dumb ass down. So was that a business and that's and a and like a protection idea that everything then would go through him because we didn't understand. It was like he was manipulating my situation, knowing I needed help with it. Like it was like. Do you feel it was like on some pimp shit? Yeah, and then I, and then I ain't pick up on it till when we beefed mm -hmm. because I don't have no weed and then I'd be lagging on some money, but I just made. 50,000, 60,000 this week. Uh, why am I blowing up your phone while you with another bitch and I need like $20? Like, mm -hmm. yo was just doing me dirty. Like, it was annoying as shit. So now I start popping. I swear to God. Oh my God. You want to see the receipts of that too? No, I'm, I'm just asking you. The I, fuck? 
I'm not lying. They ain't they playing. Yo. So you wouldn't get. So when you got all your money, you would just give it to them. Huh? When you got all your money, you would just give it to them, or if you had a booking, how did that work? So me, if I'm in a relationship, I feel like my money is your money. Like what? We gonna go to the ends of the earth? Because it's it's like me. Action is all. You can't. You can say a lot. You can try to say I love you, and you can try to say I got your back. Watch when you run it up. Um, it's it's ours. It's ours. I really did what I said it was, and then I thought he was going to fuck with me even more for real because it was like I'm showing up with my word. Cause I don't know, like I I don't know. I see my sisters and my my mother when they make money, nigga, they put that fire on his pops, like mm -hmm. or behind the man, like. And then she, the man takes yeah, care of the like household. she the back end, she making the money and all this other shit. But he gonna facilitate it correctly because you that bitch that's being the back end. Like all right, bet. I'm thinking he had my back. It was like more like a control thing. So then say if he disagree with me or something, he raises his right hand, nigga, my clothes are either outside or like it was a control tactic. And I'm like, oh, this is a game with you. You was this is hard to play with. Mm -hmm. Uh uh. So the when fuck? you were making the money, you, yes, you, you would give it to him. Yeah, but I was cool. And then and you were cool with that. Yeah. So it was never like cuz I think what most people didn't really understand the dynamics of Because now cuz like now cuz I'm thinking like, "All right, since we not together respectfully, can I have my shit back then?" What? What? Like, can we like part ways respectfully, yo, cuz I respectfully made that money for real. Bitch, it's mine. Bop, bop, bop. Jeez, you was childish, bro. Oh God. I mean, I just didn't think it was going to go that left. Like you really that right me like so I start popping my shit because I even asked them. I said, "Say like, all right, so we riding for each other like this, and, and and yeah, and I'm doing this for you. Say if we don't, this we disagree on shit. Like, can I just part ways and have my own shit? We start looking at houses and stuff, and and putting all my shit in my account. He was just like, like he was, he was, he he was slow to answer. He was acting slow, like like I didn't ask, but I just asked. I think what he said was when he was here is that part of what you didn't understand was the investment he put into what you all were building, and he that he was recouping it. it. He yeah, recouped all of it though. I mean, at least two point nine million dollars. Mm. I seen cash? it all in. Nigga, not just cash, but them, you know Zeus. They cut the yeah. checks, my nigga. We ran up a lot che of money. Zeus checks are good. Yeah. Uh -huh. And all the checks were going in his name. No, they was going in my name, and I signed it over to his name. And then he would deposit that. Yeah, his a bank account. Got it. That we had access to. That we would like, yeah. So it was like, till I didn't have no access, till I didn't have no say so, I was like, oh, yeah, I got to make new money, yo. Why? Because I'm not even ready to argue with your bitch ass with no lawyer with nothing. I'm just going to learn from it. Mm. What? I didn't know I had to really protect myself. Like, love really do fuck you up. Love really do blind a nigga, my nigga. I was blind, bro. Just because I love y'all. And I'm thinking like, all right, if I do this and be down and shit, if I make 300000 or 200000 this week or this month, bro, you're going to get my hard work. I, I made you proud. Mm -hmm. I didn't think I had to be safe with you. I thought I was safe. Mm -hmm. So when we disagree about shit, I'm not safe, nigga. I'm back on my ass, nigga. My shit is outside. I'm like, oh, all right. I see how you move. You just not that type of nigga. But, all right, cool. So what? I'm going to get my shit and go. So hearing that clears up a lot of things. And her situation was certainly different. But I cannot stress this enough. If you are not in the same situation as Krishan, Definitely get your own bank account, put things in your own name. Doesn't matter how much you love the person, get your own bank account. And I think we're all on the same page here. Blueface and Krishan could be together, might be together because they're very quiet. My advice to Krishan, when he's sleeping, take a video. Don't take a picture because some people might say it's photoshopped. Take a video. So the next time he starts with the nonsense, bam, you got your proof. And for those people that are saying that she doesn't need any proof, there's always going to be people that are going to want to see the proof. There are people that want to see receipts. Otherwise, it's going to be her word against his. Anyway, if Krishan is with Blueface right now, she has said, that she's not using protection with Blueface, which of course is very dangerous because Blueface is for everybody. Oh. For sure. <laughs> that you were with just the other day. For sure. That you just had sex with the I'm other just day. Being honest. That you just had sex with the what other day. What are you day. talking you about? You say you're being honest. <laughs> Who said the sex for <laughs> I mean, in the office, you told me you might be pregnant. Because I said, because you know, like, if they. 
I heard that. If Don't stutter. I said, I'm like, I'm going to Do you really think you're pregnant? Like, for real? I'm fertile. I just had a baby. I know, but y'all just and he had, had it. You just had So it was like. He what? Yeah, it's talking about this is my pussy on crib. I'm like, whatever, you yeah. Wait. So I've never had. Wait, wait. Yeah, I've had. That's why I like these new relationships I'm trying to like build. It's just so hard because he just. He, it's, it's just so hard. Wait, okay, the ice. I'm working on myself, okay? <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying, I'm trying. I've been baby. broken up, and he just did an interview the other day with his baby mom here on the Do show. Do you want receipts? No, no. Oh, I but she also has said she wants more kids. And in her case, I think she wants the same baby daddy for all 12. And right after the Jason Lee interview, Krishan was on Instagram Live letting her fans know what was up. Because I'm dragging like him. I became him. Fuck that. I wanted to get my rocks off the other day. I did that. I might be pregnant too. I don't know. But look, um. And then I still get what I want. What are you talking about? You still feeling like you have to pull up for me. Yeah, you, know, like you weird. And then I'm not letting you see it coming. That's big. You can't see it, so you can see me. What if I want to get my rocks off? Just like when they come in I'm like, what? But I know him. I've been here with him before he went overseas. He just flew overseas. <laughs> He's taking his kids, <laughs> and I'm gonna go overseas to make a baby. I'm gonna do what the fuck I want. You have more kids? Do you want more kids in the future? Uh, I always knew I wanted to be a mom. I always knew I wanted to have twelve kids. So one down, one on the way, and how was the last ten ago? So. Meanwhile, this is what the first lady of MILF music is doing, Jane Alexis. This is what she has posted. Clyde, right? right? But who were the 03 Bonnie and Clyde? Yeah, Beyonce and Jay-Z. Yeah! Oh, <laughs> no! Let's go! I got to Let's go! Right. She's quick. That's what do you mean? That's fucking horny in this motherfucker. Look at it. Mm. Mm. Shit! What are your thoughts? It's like, I'm like, I don't give a fuck what bitch you with. Because they do. Fuck, you said had to find a new bag. I was with my food. Yeah, what would you say? I might put it in his face because he wanted to take it. I didn't do yeah, the boy. Make my water break. Nah, I'm only thing that's broke is my fucking water. Gave birth to my kid for that. Y'all yeah, know I hate that nigga. It's a hate and love relationship. Thank you so very much for watching. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. And if you have any hot tea for me, message me on Instagram. I love you guys. Bye.